In this video, we will be studying about the acute, obtuse and reflex angle. See, in the previous video, we have studied that when two lines intersect each other, they make a exact 90 degree angle this way. When one line is perpendicular to the other line, means that is straight on the other line, in that case they make the 90 degree angle. But all angles are neither 90 degree nor complete angle or you can say straight angle of 180 degree. Some angle might lie in between, some uh, angle might lie here, some angle might lie here or here, right? So in that case we have divided the angles into three equal parts. Number one is the acute angle. Now acute angle means an angle smaller than a right angle is called an acute angle like 10 degree angle, 20 degree angle, 45 degree angle, 60 degree angle or I can say 75 degree angle all these angles, 30 degree angle, all these angles less than 90 degree angle are known as your acute angle you make acute angle like this this might be a 30 degree angle then this might be a 60 degree angle or this might be a 75 degree angle so all these if this is a triangle then this is a acute angle because this might angle be might of 45 degrees right you can uh, take the protector and check the angle and after that after practicing some angles you will, by seeing only you will be able to find out that whether it is an acute angle or obtuse or reflex. Now obtuse angle, an angle larger than 90 degree but less than 180 degree are called obtuse which, which means that angle larger than your right angle and less than your straight angle are called obtuse angle. Let's say angle 110, 120, 150 degree angle, 160 degree angle. All these angles are obtuse angle. Now, we make right angle like this. Straight, this is the right angle. Right angle. We make acute angle like this less than a right angle let's say 60 degree angle and if I say this and one more 90 degree the straight line becomes a straight angle now the angle line between 90 degree and 180 degree angle means right angle and straight angle means in this quadrant are all obtuse angles all these angles are obtuse angles. So let's say 120 degree. This is an obtuse angle. Now reflex angle. An angle greater than straight angle. is called reflex angle now let's say this is 90 degree angle if I stretch a line it becomes a straight angle if I take one more line it becomes a reflex this is 90 degree angle so I take some line here 
So it is greater than 90 degree angle or I take some line here. It is again greater than 90 degree angle. So it becomes a reflex angle. Let's say this is a reflex angle. Let's say this angle is of 210 degrees. So these are your reflex angles. Now we have to tell what type of angles are these. See this angle is less than 90 degrees. So it is an acute angle. This is greater than 90 degrees. So it is an obtuse angle. This is a 90 degree angle. So it is a right angle. Now this is greater than 180 degrees. So it is a reflex angle. 180 degree angle, this is a straight line and this angle is a 180 degree angle, so it is a straight angle. Now, these are again, this angle is also less than 90, this angle is also less than 90. So, when you uh, place your protector on this line and find out the angle of this, and uh, place the protector on this line and find out the angle of this line, you will find both the angles are less than 90 degree. So the angle less than 90 degrees is known as the acute angle. I hope you have completely understood this. Do download our Scholars Learning app and enjoy the learning experience with us.